In the intricate game of human connection, first dates are like navigating an unpredictably changing route to a familiar destination without the convenience of Google Maps. It's a journey where each turn can feel uncharted, each path uniquely ours, irrespective of past travels. Here, emotional intelligence doesn't just serve as our compass, it becomes our North Star, guiding us through these varied landscapes. So whether you're a seasoned catcher of hearts or stepping out to pitch for the very first time, today's Odyssey delves into mastering this terrain. We'll uncover three pivotal strategies to guide you and your new partner from first base through to third base and beyond. Welcome viewers to Couch Psychology, Life and Love Explained. The initial trio of dates are akin to the opening scenes of a play where characters are unveiled and plots are delicately woven. Here, emotional intelligence isn't just beneficial, it's crucial. But what have I told you? There are three keys, three unique strategies rooted in the richness of emotional intelligence that could transform these initial encounters from fleeting meetings into the foundation of something truly profound. Imagine for a moment the power to not only grasp the unspoken emotions of your date, but to respond in a way that deepens your connection, builds trust and sparks an undeniable attraction. This isn't the stuff of fairy tales, but the practical magic of understanding, empathy and genuine connection. Let's explore these keys together, unlocking the secrets to making your first three dates unforgettable. Step one, attuned at listening, the first date. Embarking on the first date, imagine it as your scene from before sunrise, where every conversation is a journey, every word a step closer to understanding the soul before you. This day is not just about sharing stories. It's about diving deep into the essence of those tales. With the same intensity, Jesse and Celine share their dreams and philosophies walking through Vienna. In this moment, the world around you blurs, leaving only the space where your narratives intertwine. Listening becomes an art form where every pause, every laugh and every sigh is a clue to the deepest desires and fears of your date. This level of attunement creates in an environment of safety and intimacy akin to reaching first base in a way that promises more depth to come. It's about making your date feel like the only person in the world, ensuring they know their words are not just heard, but felt, creating a bond that sets the stage for everything that follows. Step two, expressive empathy, the second date. The second date builds on the trust and connection established during your first meeting. Picture this as your notebook moment where Noah's understanding of Ali transcends the spoken word, reaching into the depths of empathetic connection. Here, your ability to reflect back what your date is feeling to, to truly step into their shoes and to communicate that understanding is paramount. It's like hitting a double and sliding into second base where the thrill of the chase turns into a deeper exploration of mutual feelings. In this space, every shared experience, every laugh and tear is an opportunity to deepen your connection, making each other feel understood and valued. This empathetic exchange is the emotional equivalent of stealing second base. It's bold, it's risky, but it paves the way for a more profound and intimate connection, setting you up for the chance to advance further in the game of love. Step three, positive reinforcement, the third date.
approaching the third date, think of it as your la la land finale, where Sebastian and Mia support each other's dreams with unwavering belief and positivity. This date is about reinforcing the connection you've built, focusing on the qualities and strengths of your partner that you admire. Just as a coach encourages a player to swing for the fences, your positive reinforcement is about boosting your date's confidence, acknowledging their unique traits, and celebrating their victories, no matter how small. It's the emotional equivalent of rounding second and eyeing third base, where the anticipation of something more is palpable. In this atmosphere of mutual admiration and encouragement, you're not just playing the game, you're changing it, setting the stage for a deeper, more meaningful connection. This approach lays the groundwork for a relationship built on respect, understanding, and genuine affection, making every moment feel like a step closer to home plate, where the possibility of love awaits. In the grand scheme of dating, these three strategies form the cornerstone of a successful approach to emotional intelligence. By mastering attuned listening, expressive empathy, and positive reinforcement, you transform first dates from simple get-to-know-you affairs into profound experiences of connection and mutual understanding. Remember, the goal isn't to manipulate or perform, but to genuinely engage with and understand your date on a deeper level. This approach not only sets the stage for a potentially beautiful relationship, but also enriches you, making you more attuned, empathetic, and positively engaged in all your relationships. So thank you for joining me today. So as you venture forth into the world of dating, armed with these insights, remember the most profound connections are built on the foundations of genuine, of genuine emotional intelligence. Until next time, may your dates be as enlightening as they are enchanting.